hand in my knee bag, yeah, let's do it. Y'all see me fly and never drop down, drop down, smoking high in my Hey everyone, welcome back to another Clash Royale video. Today I'm back at it, playing some more Clash, and we are going to start off with Prince here. I made Little Prince, We're, we made a little change here going with the evil bomber rather than the uh, recruits. I still think recruits are really, really solid. Um, even though they're not evolved, just their split lane capability, I think is top notch. So we're gonna arrows down the firecracker and hopefully be able to force some pressure out on that left side. See if our see if we can force something out. Our opponent's gonna go with wizard. So now that our, knowing that our opponent's got wizard, we're gonna drop a poison here. So our opponent's rocking uh, the regular princess tower, which is definitely gonna help us out a lot. We haven't played any of our evolutions, either the Battle Ram or the Bomber, but I think we'll be in a pretty decent spot. Our opponent's gonna go with the Golem, so let's go Battle Ram immediately at the bridge, see if we can force something out um, early by our opponent. Yeah, our opponent definitely didn't want to go with the Knight. Um, let's get a Inferno Tower going right here. I think it makes sense to play it here on this tile. You could also play it one tile over to the right here, but I think we'll be okay. We're gonna go with the Bomber here. And we're going to arrows this down. Um, should be able to take out the knight. Okay, so we're definitely going to get punished right here. But I think it was worth it considering we can get some more damage. And I think I think in double elixir we'll definitely be able to get the advantage here. So we need to take out the... Yeah, we need to take those out pretty quickly. So we're going to go with the battle ramp because I think it will take the hit from the flying machine. And at least buy us some time. So the Princess Tower is able to start targeting the Flying Machine. I think we're going to take one hit anyways. So against the Knight, we may want to just go with the Giant, pull it back, and essentially just kite it, just so we can get some damage and also not have to spend any on defense, really. So our opponent's going to go with the Wizard, which, I mean, I don't blame him, but the Giant is going to pummel that left side, at least for four hits, I would say. Yeah, that, there's that fourth hit, so really good stuff. We're going to go with... Inferno Tower. We're going to go with the Poison right here. That should take out the Bats. And then let's go with a Little Prince here. Knowing that our opponent's got the uh, Void Spell, it's going to be pretty big for us because we're going to have to find a way to get some um, good offense going or defense going against the that Golem. So I want to go with Evil Battle Ram here. This may be crazy, but with 30 seconds left, I, I think it's the right move for now. Um, we're going to go with the Inferno Tower, and then we're going to have to block the Void that's going to come down. And that's one reason why I dropped it going down the other lane. We're going to go with the Giant here. That should take two of the hits. And I think we just need to poison this out, and we'll be in a really, really good position. And I think just like that, we're able to steal a really, really solid victory. And if we went into, um, you know, Sudden Death, we're able to definitely take out that left side tower. Let's hop into another one here. All right, how to another match here. So I wasn't even able to use the evil bomber last game, but you know, we're gonna go with the little prince and see if we can use it this game. Our opponent's got the knight, so definitely a really, really nice target to be able to use the um, evil bomber on because they're gonna drop from the back. They're gonna be working on my giant and basically have a perfect lineup for us. So see what our opponent's gonna have for us. We're gonna go with the poison spell right here. Our opponent's got Tesla, so Definitely not the building we wanted to see um, for our battle ram, but Giant's gonna start beating that down. And let's just hold off a bit, wait for that to expire, and see if we wanna go with the battle ram. So we're gonna go battle ram. It's not gonna make it to the tower. Um, I doubt our opponent's really gonna play. Oh, he does play stuff. You definitely don't have to, if, you, if your opponent has the battle ram and you have dagger duchess tower, you definitely don't have to. I think after the nerf, you definitely will need to because they're going to nerf it to where the Dagger Duchess only has 6 daggers. Um, we're going to go with the Bomber right here. So our opponent's got the Evil Wizard. That Evil Wizard is going to be really, really annoying for us to have to deal with. We're going to go Little Prince, and then I really hope Little Prince and Royal Recruits are going to be able to do it. We, do, we have arrows instead of the Royal, um, Royal Delivery because Royal Delivery had one of those... Um, oh, this is going to be a problem. We're going to have to go Inferno Tower afterwards we'll have to make sure it targets the uh balloon instead that's going to be three hits from the balloon that's going to be oh two hits okay i'll definitely take that so definitely a rough spot for us to be in so now that we know it's a minor with uh it's like a minor balloon deck that i haven't seen in quite some time we know how to play this better so our opponent's going to go with the knight we're going to go cycle a bomber here let's get to an evil bomber as soon as possible 
Our opponent's got Tesla, so we'll have to keep that in mind. And we're going to go with the Giant here. And we're going to go with the Battle Ram here. Take the hit from the Barbarians. And then we're going to go and poison this uh, Wizard. Maybe I should have hit that Tesla. It's arguable I probably should have hit that Tesla. It's actually probably very probable that I should have done that, but I didn't do that. It is what it is. Um, we're going to go with the Infernal Tower right here. We're going to go with... Oh, wow. That was a poorly placed uh, Infernal Tower right there. E. We're going to have to... Oh, wow. It actually... We actually survived that um, somehow. Anyways, we're going to do this. We're going to go with the Evil Battle Ram. Let's just load up this left side and pray that we're able to make something happen here. Um, evil Bomber is going to lock onto that tower for a second hit. And the evil battle ram still alive. Ooh, we were so close to having a miracle happening there, I think. Let's go Little Prince here. So we're able to come back, sort of. We're going to go Giant here. That should take the hit from the Miner. Um, ooh, I wanted it to go to the right. That's going to cost me for sure. Um, we're going to go with Royal Recruits right here. Let's get a um, battle ram going as well. That Tesla is going to be definitely annoying. Uh, we're going to arrows this down. Um, I wanted the battle ram to connect to that tower. I think this is going to be a really, really close loss here. Um, yeah, it's going to be rough. That's good game we'll play. Let's hop into another one. All right, hop into another match here. So we're up against a slightly weaker Dagger Duchess tower. Um, we can go with the battle ram. Our opponent's going to go with the Phoenix. So is it Golem? Is it Giant? Is it RG? Oh, maybe it's just Lava Hound. We're going to go Little Prince right here. Oh man, I hate it when that happens. Sometimes they just like switch lanes on you. We're going to go with the Giant here. That should be able to kite the Phoenix. So pretty good stuff, I'd say. He's going to log to help finish off the uh, Little Prince, but quite a bit of Elixir just to take out the Little Prince. Let's get arrows ready, see what our opponent's got for us. Um, oh, Fisherman. Okay, that's definitely a good move by our opponent right there. Because um, that's going to activate King Tower. Yeah, barely on that, on, you know, a little bit of hit points left, and barely able to activate King Tower. Our opponent's got the... Ooh, okay. We're gonna go Bomber here, and then let's go with the Battle Ram. Kind of aggressive, actually, but that um, Fireball is gonna prevent our opponent from Fireballing our Little Prince. And let's get our LP going. Um, the Skeleton King got kited back. We're going to arrows this. We're going to miss the uh, tower, but that's okay. I really just wanted to take out the uh, Skeleton King. Um, ooh, that's a lot of Skeletons. We're going to drop a Giant here. Just be, just take some of the hits from the Skeletons and preserve our Princess Tower a little bit. Um, okay, we need to get one more Bomber down. I don't think he's going to play anything where I can just drop a Bomber. Yeah, it's not going to be worth it, I'd say. We can definitely kite the Phoenix using the Bomber, though. Um, yeah, let's do that. We're gonna drop Bomber and kite the Phoenix. And I think that that's a pretty good move, I'd say. Right side tower should start switching targets to the Skeletons. That's really good. Let's go with the Royal Recruits here in the back. So, not really sure what our opponents got for us. Okay, there's the, um, there is the Royal Giant. So, we're gonna arrows down the Firecracker. That's really annoying. Let's get a uh, Evil Battle Ram going. See what our opponent's got for us. I don't think that's... Oh, that might get kited, actually. Oh, it doesn't get kited. That's really good. It doesn't knock back the um, Skeleton King after that uh, nerf. But the Evil Bomber's locking onto that tower. Evil Bomber clutch. And the Evil Barbarians lock onto that tower. That's decimation at its finest. We're going to go and cycle some Royal Recruits right here. Um, I think we may be able to get the Infernal Tower down in the nick of time. Take out the, uh, Royal Giant, the Evil Royal Giant. Let's arrow down the Evil Firecracker. And I think that's going to be able to seal the game here with about 10 seconds left. I don't think our opponent's going to be able to do much of anything. We're going to poison this. And I think just like that, we're able to bounce back here in a really, really dominant, dominant victory. If you guys like this video, please like, comment, subscribe for more. And I'll see you next time.